Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Outlast. Last time, Freeloaders, we entered the sewers, and we turned the female valve mm -hmm. as half of our objective here. Yep. And we found the spooky pig man, yep. quote unquote pig man. Pig man. And we lured him behind us in this drain, so he's like pretty much right behind us. Yep. Where you should point. Yep, give him a little run around. And now, Ted's going to book it. We're just gonna go forward. So go! Here we go! Here uh, we go, freeloaders! Go, go, go! Stop I, crouching! I Oh, I forgot how to uncrouch. Go, 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 go. I got stuck behind the pipe. Okay, take it right. Where do I go? Nope. Right? Keep going straight. Oh. There you go. And then left. Yep, down there. Okay. How do I get. How do I get. How do I get Can down there? Can you not axe there? Oh X? boy. No, it's not this way. I Are was you wrong. sure? I was wrong. Oh boy. Okay, so we tricked him. So it's going to be to the right here. Right? Not that one, but the one after it. Careful, he's going to be coming back. When? Where? Oh god, I hear him. Yeah, we can hear him. Where is he? Though? So he's probably going to be coming from where we ran from. Uh, the direction you're facing is exactly where you have to go, though. So yeah, head that right way. Right there? Yep. Okay. Okay. This is good. Just be ready to go at any time, I would say. Oh, I know. Okay, so no no sneaky pass. Don't fucking look back. Dude, this is what you gotta do. It, it creates more spooky atmosphere. Okay, so go in there. Let's close the door. Is there a locker in here? Oh, yes. Uh, okay, there yes, is. There's several. We're so good to go. So let's hit the thing, We're and then safer. let's go into the locker. All right. Because I feel like that's a good idea. Oh, yeah, for sure. Dude, go in the lockers! Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Jeez, man. You Dude, I got to make it suspenseful. You did it. Man. I, well, okay, I was actually wasn't too suspended. Suspended. <laughs> suspended. God, I love when you wear your sunglasses at night. Listen, they're good on my glass eyes. Glass eyes? My glass eyes. Everybody, did you know that Pat has glass eyes? Two of them. That actually work. Yeah. They function. Yeah. Like real eyeballs. Um, What if he opens up the locker? Get ready to run. Um, just we're in screwed. case. Just in case. We're screwed. He better not. He better not. Okay. Oh, God. Okay, we're good. I just have a feeling Should like one of these times that he's actually going to open up our locker. That'd be scary. Like, he's just going to turn around and he's going to be like, I fucking knew you were in there. I can smell you a mile away, bitch. Okay. Now I think we have to go to that, like, pipe thing that I tried to have us go before. Like, you didn't have to call me a bitch. That was insensitive. I want to see if there's anything over here. Nope. There's nothing over here. Don't. Yeah, there is. Come on, guys. Oh, uh, sneaky batteries. Jeez, freeloaders. Okay. Here we go. Um... Wait, which way do I have to it's go? To in? the right here. Oh, descend down that pipe. Yeah, that we, yeah, yeah. That I thought we had to before. Gotcha. To the left. Okay. Uh, I like this peekaboo tactic. It's very Mike Tyson esque of you. What? Mike Ty Mike Tyson's boxing style was like called the peekaboo style. Why? Because he was like he held his gloves up like right next to his face, and he would just like peek through his gloves. Oh, weird. So he had like a super strong defense. Gotcha. Okay. So... I think he hung up right. Yeah, so let's go this way. And I think we just go down. Okay. I mean, that's what I said last time, and I was terribly wrong. Hey, oh, no, this time it go. worked. Woo! Bye, guys. Screw bye, you. Bye, big pig guy. You're the worst. Your family has AIDS. Oh, call wow. Them, call them, because they're dying. Call the doctor to get rid of the AIDS. There is no cure, but hey, we don't care about you. Is there no cure? There's no cure. So am I going to die then? Do you have AIDS? No. You're fine. Oh. But yes, eventually someday you'll die, Ted. Oh. I know, I'm sorry. I just that dropped this from bad to, on you. to good to bad again. Is that guy still alive? No, I don't think so. Do you know that they found like a, like a mummified monk and they're like, he's still alive because he's meditating. Really? Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah, they're like, some experts agree that he's alive because he's in the lotus pose. Uh, and I was like, are what? You, are you fucking kidding me? I'm sorry, he's is he dead. breathing? Does he have a pulse? He's not gonna, he's dead. They were like, 
Well, they they say it's a different kind of living. Like he's not gonna get Whoa. up and grab a coffee and newspaper. Oh, oh that looks that like it would steam. kill us. Screw that steam. Oh yeah, it did hurt us a little bit. Yeah, so let's be careful of steam. Not not the the thing. The that engine, we, the game the, engine. The game engine. No. Wait, is this where we came down from? Nope. Oh, hey, buddy. Uh. Um, Listen, I'm not scared of you. Okay. I'm not scared of you. You, you, you just, he's, he's throwing us a surprise party. He's like a kitty. He's like, meow. He's like, guys, get ready for the surprise party. Here we go. Get surprise. surprise okay. Still have to find a way out of the sewer. That's a new objective? I thought that was our I, old objective. What the? I don't know why what we needed. What just happened to, here? Why did we need to turn the valves in order to come down here? I and then up think here the water, we drained the water. Okay. Actually. That was fast. Okay. This is a weird hallway. I don't like this hallway. Is this a hallway? That's, I would call it a tunnel. A sewage way. Tunnel fairway. Oh. What? 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 Let's take a left into that door. Yeah. Oh, I like that idea. Yeah. Close the door behind you? Yep. Yep. Wait, there's a guy talking to you? What? He's over there. Oh, hey. I don't know, buddy. Okay, that's it. We were friends for a while. Alright. Well, you, you have just, a good time. You just stay in your little fort that you made for yourself. It's and nice. we'll go down here. Bye. Bye. Oh, we got a new note. The hell? The patients know Dr. Wernicke is dead? One asks me, what kind of experiments does a dead doctor perform on living patients? What is Project Wall Rider? What are all these questions about? I have so many unanswered feelings. Feelings? Yeah. Mm. Oh, look, <laughs> is, that, is that blood now? Male. Well, don't go to the female Female. ward. Oh, why not? Ted, do not go that way. But there's blood that way. We're boys. Go to the male. Yeah, we're boys. We're boys. Oh, there's blood this way, too. Whoa! He's a boy, too. Is he? That's a boy. Maybe. Maybe not. He's got boy shoulders. Dude, you don't know what boy shoulders look like. I've got boy shoulders. What are you, a pediatric guy that creeps on little children? Nope, that's not me, man. Oh. Not at any Nah, not at me. Oh, shower time. Wait, you splish, splish, oh, splish. It's poop, that's poop water. Oh, gross. You just showered in poop water. Yeah, but do any of these guys need to poop? It doesn't look like they do. Uh, you know what? That's a good question. It's so shiny. But we, we have... like I could interact with We them. have seen bathrooms. Yeah, but I don't think... How is any we of it functioning? Listen, it's a good question on just how they're alive in general. That's true. I like how you said that word there. What? Wait, what? What was that? I don't... Okay, let's... I don't see what um, these let's just noises keep going. are happening. Let's just keep going. Oh, I'll do doorway? it. Doorway? No, I can't go through the door. Okay. Oh, it's crawling the bloodstream. Yep. <laughs> Nothing we're like, like a, a trip through the bloodstream. We're like blood cells or the magic school bus when they go through the human body. I was actually just going to make a magic school are bus reference. Are you serious? Yep. I was going to say, like, oh, just like the magic school bus. To the magic school bus. Hey, I I also, when I was little, I got sad at that show because I was like, school will never be this cool. Field That's trips true. will never be this awesome That's true. At, at, in real life. This is just making me depressed. Although, to be 100% honest, I think a lot of parents would have, like, if they found out that that's what this teacher was doing, they'd be like, that's a witch. You, you took our kids into space? Sorry. What? You went in a live volcano with my kids? You went into someone's nostril? Are you kidding me? This is, not only is this impossible, it's unsanitary. Who did you, who, who gave you permission? I certainly didn't. I thought you were going to go to the park. Is that what that permission slip I signed was? Listen, I didn't read it. I was half drunk when I signed it. Oh, now we got a bad teacher and a bad parent. Yeah, I'm just, I'm trying to create moral ambiguity everywhere. <laughs> but uh, That's what life's all about. Yeah. That's what I learned when I got older. We'll go, we'll go more in depth on that and what's in these doors around us on the next episode. All right. So until next time, you have been fully loaded. So long, everyone. <laughs>